here at the flight Irvine, a new area they're developing all this common uh, offices, chair offices, really nice conferences. Still just early in the stage, they have the food called the mess hall area, and then they just started off soft opening just a couple weeks ago. So Dave is gonna show us a little bit of what's happening. This is all brand new. That's pretty fancy vending machine. They actually have like quinoa, hazelnut oatmeal. Wow. They have tender salmon stuff. This is very. It's like a hipster. Yeah, a hipster. <laughs> it's very gourmet. Oh wow! Even you can get a hat. No book. <laughs> wow, that's very interesting. My customer. Hey, how you doing? I'm David. Nice to meet you. What we got here, Chef? We got right here the batter's box, two peas, leg and thigh, chicken, hot, and then our fries, and we're gonna have our sandwich right there. Awesome. Chicken sandwich, same hot, same level, good stuff. A little bit of that uh, chipotle sauce in there. Bomb. Okay. Fire, brother. Great, great. All right. Thank you, Chef. Appreciate it. No problem. You got it. And Chef Fernando hooked us up with uh, his famous fried chicken. We got it mild, you can get up to Inferno, which we didn't want to try. He wanted to try the hot one. I don't know, I'll just go with mild. I like flavor over heat, okay? So let's try that out. The crust is on the harder side, right? It's more like it keeps the shape at the same time you bite into it. Flavor, definitely some Cajun spice in here too. Good, and the chicken is juicy. We have this fried chicken uh, sandwich. It's big and chunky, it's got coleslaw, it's got this pink sauce on it, on a, a toasted bun. It's very thick actually, look at the thickness of the um, chicken. Mm. Oh, the coleslaw is all right? Yeah, coleslaw. I like the toasted bun feel of it. Chicken is juicy. Good solid chicken sandwich. Flakes. You can see the flakes. See the flakes on it? The texture. Yeah, look at the texture on the flakes here. Right, um, and also the decoration of flowers. Really beautiful, very colorful. Pretty light. Um, yeah, not as heavy as it looks. Yeah, yeah, it looks heavy, right? But it's not really that heavy. Flaky. Yes, right? You look at it, it's kind of like the flaky type. Like like water based with some mango flavor. I could taste a chunk of mango in it. Yeah, sandwich. yeah. After it was melted. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's more like mango based fruit kind of feel. Oh, you see that little pieces of nuggets of pudding right here? Yeah, this is the good stuff. Because it has a lot of flavor, right? Mm -hmm. mm. So this is one of the signature uh, butterfly pea coconut drink. Okay, so butterfly pea is supposed to be a natural um, kind of diet, right? Kind of coloring. Plant-based. Uh, yeah, plant-based fruit coloring. That's not, you know, like chemical, like most of the coloring. And then it's got pieces of coconut in here. And this is a smoothie kind of drink that's supposed to be light and natural. 
Okay, so let's try it out. Mmm, I taste the coconut. Chunky coconut, icy. This is like 100% coconut juice. No oh, water added. Yeah, not, you know sometimes it's too watery? Yeah, it's not that. Uh, yeah. it, it tastes like creamy, buttery. Um, yeah, no additional sugar. It's naturally sweet because it's That's right. Yeah. That's right. Like, no, yeah, no added sugar. So you know this is really fresh and natural. I like it.